So please pay attention. I have your cup that you can cut here. Now, I want us to learn on dealing with emotions in mediation. We will have to ask a few questions at the when we end, so you may pay attention. So we will look at, you should be able to, by the end of this session, you should be able to understand how to handle the emotions in mediation and understand aspects of uh, emotions in mediation. Please look at me. What do you think is happening to me? Anyone? Are you getting carried away? Maybe crossing over something that went for me. It's affecting you now. Good. So that is part of the emotions. Welcome. <coughs> Thank you, Caroline. Now, after showing you the bit of the uh, emotions, like it or not, we always come across emotions in mediation. And there's no specific place where you get it. But mostly at the beginning, because that's why people come with their positions. It's only after you've understood them, you have changed them, that you find those emotions go down. It only takes a very simple way of clearing up something. Just clearing the air something, you bring down the emotions, then you find that you are now moving towards settling that dispute. In, uh... Acknowledge these emotions. They are human beings. Acknowledge. Don't behave like they are not there. There could be instances of embarrassment. Recently, we have a heated country right now, isn't it? There was a lot of embarrassment. Don't try to bring that person down. Acknowledge it is there. And now, because it is there, actively listen to both of the parties. It doesn't mean that if you are actively listening, you listening, you may take sides. Remember you are a mediator and do not be seen to take sides. Now, when you are actively listening, remember you need to be very clear with the ground rules that you have set. These are people who may be going through a lot, but ensure that these ground rules are very clear. That you may show your emotions, yes, but please respect the other person, so that this person may feel listened to. And also, remember, we have been learning, we, we are just here as, as a refresher course. We have been learning to be better mediators. Stay as neutral as you can. Create an environment of safety and trust. Because these people have come to you because they trusted in your powers. So ensure that they can clearly see that. Have you experienced any situation where someone does not trust you? Most likely because of the emotional element, isn't it? Okay, thank you. Sometimes as temperatures go rising, as people are expressing their frustration, it may be important to take a breath. Let them relax. You can take a walk around the company, it's a big company. Let them talk something else. That might lower the temperature and they really come to realize what has really brought them there. Stay focused. Focus on the interests. Remember these people want something.